Kyokushin karate is uh, different from other style. Is o- the only difference is contact. Contact means the punch and kick touch your body, contact your body. With this, actually try to knock you down. We emphasize a lot of toughen up your body. We believe that uh, you must be able to take punch before you can give people the punch. Our training here is just like in Japan. You, you are here not just training to learn to protect yourself or how to fight, but a discipline in your personal character. Today, I start my training with Shi Han Chong. Oh, you're going to join us? Yes, I'm going to join you guys. So, first thing, you have to learn this one. The greeting. Os. Os. Os lao. Os. Don't look down, look at him. Os. Yeah. Okay, this. Yes. Well, this is going to be your gi. After you put on this, this is exactly when I was in Japan. Yeah, okay. Us. Thank you. Thank you, Doc. Us. 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 Thank you, guys. I'll go change now. I have met him earlier. I think he had a good good physique and I understand he had trained a bit of Taekwondo before when he was young. So the foundation is more or less there. So I'm going to bring it up very, very quickly. Us. Uh, this your place. The first day of training, I was very, very nervous because we were doing another contact sport. I was really shocked because I said I could get myself hurt again. So I really wanted to take it step by step and listen to Shi Han Chong when he was training me so that I would ensure that the danger of me getting hurt again was minimal. He had the foundation, he had trained, he know what is martial art. So I won't do much on that. Straight to all the various uh, kick and punch where how he will have to kiai. Kiai means you yell. Hey! You, you know how to put your chi out, that way you train your diaphragm. Because that build up our chi and your stamina. Next state is where how you toughen up yourself. No, no. Shi Han Chong is known for taking something that looks like a didgeridoo and whacking it on your abdomen. Look at that, that is insane. He's using a wooden block to hit the abdomen of his students. That's nuts. I'm the last one. So let's hope he's tired by the time he gets to me. If not, I could be in a lot of pain, but it'll be, it'll be interesting. Our system is sound dangerous, but uh, actually when you train, after many years of training, your body should be able to take all these blows. So I was in the first line, so he did everybody, but he missed me. So I said, wait a minute, I can do this. Nothing, nothing for me, I guess. So I said, Shi Han Chong, can you, uh... so he came. It's your first I'm ready. lesson. I'm ready for the, uh, for the block. Uh, ready for the block? Okay. Yeah. First one was very light. Second one got heavier. Third one was a bit more uh, uh, stronger. But the fourth one. Ah. Ooh, that was the one. Oh. That didn't hurt. Us but I'm hiding it because there's so many people here. <laughs> like Shi Han Chong always says, experience the pain. Unknown to me then, the pain of the big block was only the beginning. My favorite part of the class was the demonstration by the seniors. That's until I got called. One time. When I was sitting down, they were doing demonstrations and then Shi Han Chong comes up to me and goes, you gonna chop up the tile 
my mind just went blank. I said, what am I gonna do? It's very hard, but don't worry about it. When I say go, you go. Am I gonna do this right? I've got 20 karate students looking at me, and if I fail, is it gonna be embarrassing? Is it okay because I'm a beginner to fail? You ready? Take a good breath. Don't worry about the ta. So the first time I did it, I missed it. In here, in here. Then the three times you... Okay. Push. Yeah, go back. The second time I did it, clean. Boom. Yes. Strength and power is what Shi Han Chong said. With adrenaline coursing through my veins, bruises on my body, and possibly a hairline fracture in my metacarpus, my first day of training definitely left an impression. But I'm not done yet. Shihan, Os, Jackie, Os. You have one more session to go. I have one more oh. session to go. I will give you personal touch. Your personal touch? Yeah. All right, Just give me a hug. Os. 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 I had a great one-on-one -on -one session with Shihan Chong with a beautiful uh, lush scenery. And he told me the techniques that I need to fight. 45. At the end okay. of 45. Okay. And then up. Uh, uh, one. One. Two. Uh, and the other hand high up. Uh, while you punch the other guys, the other guy come at the back. You still get him. Ah, uh, okay. But you're here it down. Sure can't, yeah. Look. Because this form of karate is about hurting the opponent and getting him down. So he showed me the punches, the kicks, and while he was doing it, he actually didn't hold back. He actually was going about 80% and it did hurt. But at the same time, I was giving it back to him as well. So he taught me all these little moves and things that you have to do. It's just, you know, three or four basic techniques you need. No. In fact, you after that, after you get him and he's still standing, you can, you can go in. Okay. The way he taught as well is not shouting. And I, I don't like those teachers who shout at you, bark instructions at you. Yeah. Oh, very calm, very very smooth, very soft. I really enjoyed his method of teaching. Us. Yeah, but don't do it that outside. Yeah, yeah, yeah of course not. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Only for protection. If I see a girl in trouble. <laughs> okay, good. All right, thank we'll you. See you in the class. See you in the dojo. Okay. The challenge was the sparring, and that was the one that I was most hesitant to do because the last time I did a sparring, I broke my nose. This January.